beautiful morning. Those birds just woke me up. <laughs> the stars last night were incredible. I woke up a few times and I was like, whoa! <laughs> Another fucking shoe. There were some animals out last night running around. And, uh, fuck, it's all the way over there. That's crazy. <laughs> it took it. <laughs> See that? There were two shoes right there. And I think I see it over there now. <laughs> I didn't know what they were. They were like these little like cat-like things bouncing around. I saw them a few times last night. They were kind of playful. One of these little animals was messing with me. <laughs> there you are. Did they fuck you up? Oh, they did fuck you up. Shit. Gonna be not as tight a fit. Damn it. I don't know if the mic picked it up, but there's a bunch of coyotes howling. I think those are the fuckers that took my shoe. No crashes, no whammies, no windies. We're going to Murray Man today. Beautiful day. I've got five water bottles and like six energy bars. I should be good for the day. I think there's probably about 60 miles to go. I'm guessing. It really feels like I'm I'm really close to Burning Man now. It's, it's just over these mountains, really. And uh, what a journey. And you might be thinking, why the hell did you put so much effort into busting your ass to Burning Man? <laughs> why is this so special, Ryan? I love it. To me, it's a lot more than just a, a raging party. It's the most accepting and loving place on the planet, and I've traveled all over the planet. It brings out the best in humanity. You'll see pieces of artwork that are just like, wow! It's so inspirational. And the people you meet from all over the world are so incredible. And fun and goofy and... It's just great. I love it. <laughs> I'm talking to my camera like Tom Hanks and Castaway talking to his football, basketball, what was that thing? What was the guy's name? Owen? Wilson! Wilson! So all those big ass mining trucks that have been passing me, this is where they all go. There's the mine. Check it out, that way to Burning Man. Just down that road. Thanks for the marker. I don't want to jinx myself, but this road certainly has not turned out to be the death trap everybody was making it out to be. Doesn't look that bad to me so far. There's the playa. Try to go across the train tracks and scoot in the, the back way. Yeah, right on. Yeah. Good luck with that. I yeah. Have radar. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I have a ticket, so I'm gonna be like, I have a ticket. Don't <laughs> for, don't arrest me. Here's a road 
for sure that goes over the train tracks into the backside of Burning Man. Do I take it? Is this my road? Is this my fork in the road? The road less traveled that makes all the difference? I think it is. And it kind of reminds me of that moment in the never ending story when a Treyu is going through those gates and you just have to believe in yourself. Don't start to doubt yourself. Be confident. Be confident. Be confident. That's what it feels like. It's a little cheesy, but man, the never ending story. Let's go for this. But I do know that once I get over there, I know there's radar. <laughs> the BLM guys are gonna be on me real fast. And hopefully they're in a good mood today. I have a ticket, obviously. I'm not sneaking in like some dirty hippie. So let's, uh, let's do this. This is the moment I've been dreaming about ever since I first went to Burning Man. Skipping that crazy ass line on my bike, going in the back way. I have no idea how they're gonna react. I've only heard stories that will come blazing down on you in their trucks and they just don't want people to sneak in, which I'm not doing. So hopefully we'll uh, we'll get this worked out. I believe, I believe, I'll betray you, I believe, I'll betray you. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah. Why don't you just get in the truck? Okay, I'll, I'll get in the truck. <laughs> Sounds good. Here I am getting a ride with my friend Shade. What's up? <laughs> this is great. It's air conditioned, it's comfy, and uh, I'm gonna be there soon, which is great. No more biking. My legs are happy. Where are you? Yeah. How long did it take you? It took 10 days. Hello. Hi, how you doing? I'm doing great. You're set. Wear your seatbelt five miles an hour. <laughs> Sounds good, I'll do it. Go to the outside of the flag line okay. and ride that all the way down. Perfect. Thank you so much. Take Appreciate care. it. Thank you so much, Shane. Have a good one. See baby! See baby! <laughs> See I am dusty and dirty and so happy. And this is the moment I dreamed of. This is the moment passing all the cars. It feels so good. I didn't have to wait in that line. That part's even more beautiful than I thought. Bastion made many other wishes and had many other amazing adventures before he finally returned to the ordinary world. That's another story. Never end story. Oh. Reach the stars. Fly a fantasy. Oh, it was awesome, man. The last bit was in the elements. I bet. Woo! Mom told me to tell you <laughs> that she left you for dead. She went to the. Okay, yeah, first, first.